Okay, uh, uh, I'll, I'll do this video. I haven't done a video in this way before. So and my teacher, David Hawkins, talks about the different levels of consciousness and talks about why it's important to avoid uh, any negative fields of energy. Negative fields of energy are vibrations. They could be teachers aligned with vi negative vibration, books aligned with negative vibration, music aligned with negative vibration. And also he talks about um, uh, luciferic, uh, luciferic inversion, uh, luciferic temptation, um, and how uh, one gets entrained into these negative fields of vibration. So the thing with uh, um, the negative energies, the higher negative, not the lower negative, the lower negative energies, the satanic energies are like uh, killing and raping and torturing. Actually, m much more scary for the spiritual seeker, the luciferic, which is um, seducing spiritual seekers with clever spiritual rhetoric, which inverges in invert spiritual truth so that the spiritual seekers don't know the difference between truth and falsehood and so get corrupted and once they're corrupted they're easy prey to take down the um to help them resonate with lower and lower fields of consciousness um so for example um uh once a teacher he says like they're like radio stations if you're watching i don't know let's say you're um um let's make it make it i can make a, a joke victim tv victim and blame tv um or let's talk about the spiritual teachers because i think one of the most shocking things and why i think david hawkins for me is the teacher to choose i mean there was only i think there's only been about four teachers that got to the highest levels of enlightenment buddha krishna uh, 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 uh sorry buddha krishna and jesus christ and recently hawkins um so and even though they're all at the heights the problem with uh, the other teachers is that they were thousands of years ago so their teachings have been distorted and reversed and and misaligned and misinterpreted over hundreds of years so even though they are the highest levels through uh, calibration, muscle testing, um, if you get get a recent teacher who's got videos and books that haven't been changed at, at, at all, then that would be the easy way to enlighten them. And basically, Hawkins has said, with his works, with his clarity, I mean, you're 10,000 times more likely to be enlightened than before. So now the thing is, you don't understand, like there is... Um, a thing, a music that came out of Motown, uh, and it's got something called the anaphylactic beat, which is a rhythm in it. And if you listen to the music, the music sounds great, but if you listen to the music, it it actually reverses your energy field. You become, uh, you, you, your energy field becomes negatively aligned. You might then suddenly think, well, it'd be nice to take some drugs after this music and go and party and have a few vodkas uh, and, and maybe take some cocaine. So even though the music sounds nice, you think you're having a good time, it actually negatively entrains your negative. So you, your whole energy field. So you might go out to a party, uh, a drug party, have some vodka. At that point, you become susceptible to demonic possession. Um, and then you can get an entity enter you because you haven't got any defense left now because you've already succumbed to the negative energy field. You can have a voice in your head say, in the name of God, go out and kill people, and you would. Um, so that's the, the seriousness of not, you know, you don't know. You just don't know what music. Um, now, usually, I mean, the great composers are in the, in the you know, Bach and Beethoven, Tchaikovsky, and Unconditional Love. But, um, you know, you wouldn't, I mean, the problem humanity has had is that, um, and Buddha and Jesus Christ said it, you know, uh, Jesus Christ said, uh, forgive them because they don't know what they're doing. Man hasn't got the, the capacity to tell the, the true, the wolf from the wolf in sheep's clothing, what sounds good, but isn't good and what is good. 
Uh, and so man often chooses the wrong. I mean, not the wrong, but the things that will lead to destruction. Um, so with muscle testing now, you've got a guide, if you use it, to stick to the true and not you know, go down the wrong path. Um, the one thing I will keep stressing, um, which is the most shocking thing, even Hawkins discovered it, was that most spiritual teachers have actually fallen. Um, and it was quite shocking and he was quite surprised. Um, so you could go and see a spiritual teacher which had thousands of followers. And then one day he falls from grace. The next day he says, um, well, God says sex is holy. So we're gonna have orgies in the ashram and actually donate all your money to the holy cause. And uh, there's, you know, and there's suddenly 97 Rolls Royces in the backyard. So, and um, the spiritual seekers would still think, well, you know, he's got thousands of followers. He's been good for a long time. Everything he's said has worked for me. So I'll go along with this. Um, so um, Hawkins describes it. There is, um, for dominion of this world, there are negative energies that do not want spiritual teachers to carry on. And so they're, they're beset by temptation to fall. Um, so the muscle testing, uh, Hawkins has written a book, Truth Versus Falsehood, where he calibrates lots of books and lots of teachers. But I suggest him, his books and himself as, um, as some of the highest books, well, the highest books, really. Um, I, reality and, I, reality and subjectivity calibrates at 1,000, 1, the highest level of enlightenment. So I share that because I want to stick to Hawkins only. I don't want to waste time with teachers calibrating muscle testing less than him. I definitely don't want a teacher that calibrates negative um, because that would be um, that, that would be very detrimental to my um, growth. So um, I just wanted to say that, that you know, the taking, um, becoming, uh, becoming aware that this information is available uh, to um, of uh, saving yourself from not falling and sticking to a true path uh, in my, in my view it, it it's wise to take uh, to go with it